OCPF top-ups have reached an all-time high this year. Members deposited some four billion Sing dollars, smashing last year's record of three billion. The CPF board says over two hundred and twenty thousand members made top-ups so far. More than half were first-timers. The number of first-timers is also double that of last year. An analyst says the increase comes as people are saving more money amidst the pandemic. There have been a lot of money given by the government uh, with through the various budgets. And because people's spending has been very low because of lockdowns and other reasons, no travel. So they have access funds or access savings. The CPF gives them a risk-free return of anywhere between two and a half to four percent. Whereas if you try to invest on your own, uh, after you cut the fees, investment uh, advisors and investment houses will charge you, you will not get that high of a return. One in two who put money into CPF accounts are also above 50 years old. Professor Agarwal says the pandemic could have prompted seniors to prepare ahead for rainy days. If people are already topping up on their own, the government has to spend less taxpayer money or the reserves in helping the retired people. Because if they save now in 15 years, this money will grow and this will become a good nest egg in retirement age.